Hello, today I'm going to teach you how to, to construct a hexagon inscribed in a circle. Remember, a hexagon has six sides, so we need six vertices along the circumference of the circle to be able to connect them to create our hexagon. Now, we started out with a circle and a center. From there, we drew already the diameter, and the diameter has two endpoints, and that's two of the six endpoints that we're going to need to create this hexagon. So we need four more. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our compass and we're going to measure the distance from that point, which is called a point of tangency, to the center of my circle. Okay, once I've measured that distance with my compass, I'm not using any of the rules or the rulers, I'm using my compass, I am going to take that measurement and I'm going to mark my circle. So I'm going to go here, mark a little point, now you can continue that arc all the way over and make it look like a basketball, but you don't have to. Okay, so I have two more points here. So now I've got one, two, three, four points. Okay, I'm going to take that distance to the other side of my diameter and I'm going to do the same thing. Okay, lots of repetition. So I'm going to mark my circle here and here. Again, you can create that whole basketball effect, but you don't have to. So now I've got six points one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm going to connect them. Connect the points with your straight edge, definitely not freehand. And we go one, and we go two, and three, and four, turn my paper and we go five and we go six and there you have it you have a perfectly inscribed hexagon inside a circle one two three four five six and that's it